There were pieces of glass in the sugar jar. David promptly ingested all of the sugar in his mouth after doing so unintentionally. As he continued to chew the sugar that was left in his mouth, he felt physically jagged pieces of glass. Regrettably, it was already too late. Now, glass is going through his digestive system. What effect will the glass fragments have once they are inside of him? Nothing, not even a dull ache or an irritating itch, is being experienced by him at this time. Where exactly does it end up? If you or your child has also done the same thing, it is absolutely essential that you watch this video till the end. Welcome back to Limitless. We took some time off, but now we're back in action. We want to thank you for watching and making it possible for us to keep doing what we do the best. What exactly happens if you swallow glass? First of all, if the glass pieces are too small, nothing bad is going to happen. However, your mouth and throat may suffer severe damage if the pieces are too large. They may become lodged in the esophagus, producing discomfort in the chest as well as the belly. In this particular scenario, you should seek medical attention right away. Just in case your kid has accidentally ingested some glass, don't try to pull it again and again. Otherwise, it will deal a significant blow to them. Many parents make their kids vomit. That's not good at all. Just visit a doctor or wait for the symptoms. Don't try any trick to pull or push the piece yourself. If the bits of glass are too small, they will be expelled from the body within 24 to 48 hours along with any food that has not been digested. If you feel your child is restless, you need a doctor's advice. They will suggest getting x-rays or MRIs done in order to pinpoint the exact location of the glass. You need to avoid self-medication and any insensible tip. It is a serious issue and only the doctor is the person who can help you in this case. They are trained to provide first aid in case of any foreign object swallowing. Now let's imagine you're drinking water in broken glass. You take a bit of glass by accident in your mouth and swallow it. What will happen? Well, if the piece is too small, it will not hurt you. But if it's bigger, it can hurt your mouth as well as your throat. When it enters the esophagus, it may stick here. Once it reaches the stomach, it can also cause severe damage to the intestines. Therefore, you should seek immediate medical attention if you're experiencing pain in the chest as well as the belly. In order to remove pieces of glass through the mouth, your doctor will employ a variety of instruments called suckers. If it has reached the stomach, he will suggest an MRI to track its location after it has been there. In severe cases, surgery is required to grab and remove the stubborn piece of glass. Can you really survive eating glass? You could have witnessed magicians quickly consuming glass bulbs at some occasion. Actually, none of this is magic. It's just a bunch of stage stunts. Don't try to practice it at home. It needs a lot of training to eat glass. When it comes to magic tricks, certain magicians are trained to safely eat glass in order to do certain tricks. Can ingesting a little piece of glass kill you? Yes, if not treated appropriately, eating a bigger piece of glass can kill you. To consume it in a safe method, one needs to practice a lot. But it's a hazardous activity and must be avoided. If sharp bits of glass penetrate your body, they have the potential to cause severe damage to the sensitive tissues there. If ingested intentionally, it can also cause infection in the mouth, throats, esophagus, stomach, and intestines. In rare cases, doctors may need to remove the piece of glass surgically. To avoid intentional and unintentional glass eating habits, it's life threatening. Now let's explore what happens if you swallow a small glass bottle. First of all, glass bottles are not too small to consume. Your children run the risk of choking if they accidentally put a piece of broken glass that is only a little size in their mouth. You must know, what happens if you consume a bottle of a smaller size made of glass? If the bottle is less than an inch in height, it will be able to travel through your esophagus without causing any discomfort to the throat. However, if it is larger than an inch, it has the potential to become lodged in the throat or the esophagus, causing severe damage to the internal organs of the body. In the stomach, it will not undergo digestion and will not disintegrate. 
Here, if its size is big, it can cause intestinal infection. However, if it is of a small size, it can be safely eliminated within 24 hours. In the event that the glass bottle is both sharp and significant in size, you should seek medical attention as soon as possible. What health risks are associated with ingesting glass marbles? Children frequently ingest foreign items, including marbles made of glass. There are situations when the object is small and does not cause any damage. However, in many instances, it may become lodged in the throat or windpipe, posing a danger for the rest of one's life. These are very painful situations. It is terrible for parents to witness their children going through difficulties of this nature. Children frequently choke on objects like coins in glass, and these instances are common. Therefore, make sure that these more delicate items are kept out of the reach of children. How about we find out what happens if you ingest some glass powder? The glass is crushed into a very fine powder to create the glass powder. In powdered form, it seems to be either salt or sugar. Imagine that someone accidentally ingests it, thinking it is something else and has no idea what it is. If you consume glass powder, what will happen to you? If the amount of powder that is swallowed is less than one tablespoon, there is no risk of experiencing any adverse effects. However, if the quantity of granules consumed is greater than one large spoonful, it may induce discomfort in the abdominal region. In many instances, the powder will not be harmful in any way. If you are experiencing severe discomfort in both your chest and belly, you should see a doctor. It is possible that he will suggest getting an MRI in order to determine what the problem is with your stomach and intestines. Please make sure that the name of the powder is written on the bottle whenever you put such powders in a bottle to store them. As a result, there will be fewer instances of people accidentally eating something. Consuming glass will be a fairly unpleasant experience. It's not like you can chew it up and swallow it since the shards of glass will merely become lodged in your throat if you try. It's going to end up being something that needs to be removed surgically from your body. The good news is, is that even if you do survive, there is a very good chance that eating glass won't have any long-term consequences for you. There are some people who have a sensitivity in certain types of glass that can cause more severe problems down the road, but this isn't common. In the event that you consume glass, whether intentionally or unintentionally, it is crucial that you get medical assistance as soon as possible. Consuming glass can lead to internal bleeding as well as other difficulties that, if left untreated for an extended period of time, might be life-threatening. Well, that's it from this video. What do you think of eating glass? Have you tried swallowing a piece of glass or its powdered form? Share your thoughts by commenting below. If you enjoyed this video, hit like and share this video with your friends to help spread awareness. Also, consider subscribing to our channel for more interesting videos every week.